So day one, start to dig some holes. Parked the digger here last night, get into it early, digger's not starting. So we seem to have dropped a cell in the battery and we just won't crank over. Being a Sunday, we're uh, not gonna get a new battery today. So let's do it by hand. And we're probably down maybe 20 centimeters. There's the rock content versus the dirt content. So uh, this hole's 600 mil round and it's got to go down to 1.1 meters. So wish me luck. Okay, it's nearly exactly an hour after we started digging this hole and luckily the rock pile didn't get very much bigger. So a fair bit of clay. Fantastic, I hope they're all like that. And we're now at 1.1 meters down a hole. So, one down. Jacob, your champion. What? Did you fix it? Yeah, I fixed it. You fixed it? Look at this, digger has moved. Every bloody hole has been dug. And now the digger's fixed. We're just gonna keep digging by hand. We're not gonna bother using the digger. We might even burn the digger. We'll see how we go. <laughs> All right, we're going to call it the end of day two. I think that's not too bad. Going solo, not too bad at all. Quite a few more to cut, but wedges on the wall. Joist brackets are on that back end. Now that I've got this done, I'll probably cut another couple of those longer joists on the two of these ones as well, and then I'll start on this beam out on the front here. And then she can all stand up and get squared and get ready for posts. Okay, a bit of an update. Uh, sorry about the wind. At least it's not raining. It's been raining for the last three days, so it's been hard work. But we do have jumbo brackets on the roof um, with the help of a roofer this week. Fantastic. Thanks, Greg. Okay, so more by way of update, I suppose, where we're at. We've only really had probably about four days run at it, um, including the roof. So obviously all the holes are dug now. I have had a few problems I run into. Was one is the, these holes that I dug. I dug in about 300 mils from the corners because normally um, the posts for the smart kits and decks don't go in the corners normally. But because mine are running down a 1.1 metre hole and all the way up to the flyover roof, um, which is not that high, obviously, I need to cut that post down. My brackets actually have to go to the post in the corner. So that was a little bit of a little bit of a learning lesson once we got our head around all of that. So obviously some more screws to go in there yet. It's just there to be braced. Um, but slightly different setup. So now I've got the two obviously got the the back plate on the wall with all the hangers on. Got a few of the joist cut ready to go. Got another pole standing also with a bearer back to the wall. Um, all very close to plumb at the moment. Waiting for some concrete in the holes next week. And I'm just putting together the front beams as we speak now. So this will be the one working from the right over there going this way. So obviously I had to calculate the 450 centre for this first hanger and then the 450 centres thereafter. Um, and again, you know, you learn to do these things easily by yourself. So very simply, I've just got a square, which I put the hanger against. Um, a couple of clamps on. A couple of clamps on, would you believe? And then that allows me to put some screws in here without any things slipping all over the place. Just take your time, nice and simple. I've obviously got a center mark. Pretty straightforward keep going see how we go today 
It's late in the afternoon, the rain's only just stopped an hour or so ago, so it's still fairly dark and stormy looking. But I'll uh, keep plugging along with this, hopefully get the other bearer ready to go with all of the connectors or hangers on there. And then um, probably stand that centre post up tomorrow, put the two bearers on. And then it's really simple, it's just cutting joists and popping them in place. And uh, hopefully we get some decking timber next week and start that. And then we tackle the issue of the angles of these jumbo brackets. Alright, until next time.